beautiful blue sky and white clouds. But have you wondered why the sky is blue? Well, it turns out it's all about chemistry. The white light from the sun is actually made up of a spectrum of colors. Now let's shine some sunlight into a prism. We can see the beautiful rainbow colors appear ranging from red to blue. Yes, blue, not violet. Common misconception of having violet included in a rainbow colors perhaps started by Sir Isaac Newton. Sir Isaac Newton was the first to discover that white light is composed of all the colors of the rainbow. But when Sir Isaac Newton said violet, maybe what he really meant was blue, just as in roses are red, violets are blue. The sky appears blue because we see the blue component of the color spectrum. But why is that? In the Earth's atmosphere, there are tiny particles such as oxygen and nitrogen molecules. When the sunlight enters the Earth's atmosphere, the light gets scattered in all directions by these tiny particles. First described in 1859 by British physicist John Tyndall, this phenomenon is called the Tyndall effect. In later years, Lord Rayleigh published a paper describing this Tyndall effect in more detail and it is commonly known as Rayleigh scattering. According to Rayleigh scattering, the amount of light scattered is inversely proportional to the fourth power of the wavelength of the light. Note that different colors of light are associated with different wavelengths, red being the longest. Put it together with Rayleigh's equation, blue light scatters more than red light by roughly 10 times, therefore the sky appears blue. However, the color of the sky is not always blue. In sunrise or sunset, the color of the sky is orange or red. Why is that? When the sunlight strikes near the horizon, light needs to travel longer distance in the atmosphere to reach our eyes. During this time, light with shorter wavelengths, such as blue, mostly gets scattered away in all directions. Light with longer wavelength, namely red, scatters less and gets through the atmosphere. Did you know that the sunset will appear more red if the air is more polluted? In the polluted air, there will be more particles present. More particles means more scattering, which means more red sunset or a redder sunset. Well, that's it for today. If you learned something new today, give this video a like, share with your friends, and smash the subscribe button.